In the beginning of May of 2010, I felt a pain in my right side that uh, was unusual. I, I know my body pretty well. And so I went to my internist and I said, uh, what is this? You know, I was worried that I had maybe appendicitis or, or something. And he said, you're, you're young, you're 36 years old. Uh, it's probably nothing. Um, you don't have any symptoms, why don't you go home? And if you, if you still feel it on Monday, uh, we'll, we'll check you out. We'll do a, a, an ultrasound or a CT scan or something like that. So the next Wednesday, I went and had a CT scan. And right when I got back to my office, I got a call from my internist who said that, um, that we needed to have a talk. That there was actually nothing wrong with my right side. But in the course of getting the CT scan, it showed that I had a tumor on my left kidney. Um, obviously that was shocking to me and, and, and scary and, and confusing and, and all sorts of those emotions. Um, he said, you have to go see a urologist immediately. So I did, I went to go see a, a, a wonderful urologist in Santa Monica um, who said, these things are typically cancerous and we will need to take out your entire kidney. Luckily, my boss, Steven Spielberg, is on the board of the USC Medical School and his office had recommended that I go see, as a second opinion, this new hotshot urologist and this uh, master surgeon uh, at USC uh, named Dr. Gill. For Mr. Small, he had this three and a half, four centimeter, so a reasonable sized tumor in the heart of the kidney. This was enmeshed within the blood vessels uh, supplying the kidney, so a, a, a difficult spot a technically challenging scenario, and I can understand why another urologist looking at this CAT scan would say, this partial nephrectomy is not doable. I mean, you need to get the whole kidney out. My wife and I went down, uh, I believe the next day, uh, to Dr. Gill's office and sat down and, and discussed my situation with him, and uh, and it was just a great experience. Just just from the get-go, the, 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 the confidence that he had in his ability uh, combined with his honesty about the situation um, was really refreshing for, for what was really scary for me and my wife. Our team though has had significant experience in uh, developing all these partial nephrectomy techniques and we've done many of these kind of surgeries before so that's what I indicated to Mr. Small and his wife Sarah that listen guys um, this is a difficult gonna be a difficult operation I think we can do it and uh, uh, if we can't we'll remove the whole kidney so uh, and I'm delighted that we were able to actually pull it off pretty straightforward. On May 27, 2010, I went into USC and had the surgery, and uh, Dr. Gill got the tumor out and preserved 80% of my left kidney. Now we gotta get on the straight I'm delighted with the outcome of uh, Jeff Small's surgery. It's now four and a half years later, cancer-free, excellent kidney function, back to life. Uh, completely in, uh, and fully. While Jeff is a VIP, I like to think that we deliver the same care for every patient. The same compassion, the same attention to detail. Dr. Gill, in addition to being one of the smartest guys on earth, has the right combination of confidence and, and a personality that's great with patients and honesty to make what is a, a, a difficult and nerve-wracking situation into something much more manageable and much more easy to deal with.